So this video is going to briefly discuss anxiety, what it is, why we experience it, and signs of anxiety to look out for. Anxiety is a normal human response to situations that we see as threatening to us, and is something that we all experience from time to time. Our brains have an alarm system, the amygdala, which works to keep us safe by constantly being on the lookout for threats. When this alarm system perceives a threat, adrenaline is released into our blood and the fight or flight response is activated, getting our bodies ready to really quickly respond to the threat by either running away from it or fighting it. And this is a basic system which is also present in animals who depend on it for survival. So the fight or flight response leads to physical changes in our bodies. Our eyes widen to improve our vision. We might notice that our breathing becomes quicker and shallower. And this helps us to take in more oxygen, but it can also result in us feeling dizzy or lightheaded. Adrenaline also increases our heart rate, so that there's more blood and oxygen going to our muscles. It also makes our muscles tense so that we can move fast, and it speeds up our thoughts so that we can make quick decisions. We might also notice that we become sweaty, which is to stop our body from overheating. We might also get butterflies in our stomach, a dry mouth, or find that we are trembling or shaking. And these are all automatic responses, and it's our body's survival mechanism. So nowadays, we're not often in life or death situations, and many of the stresses that we face can't actually be fought or run away from. So these physical symptoms aren't useful to us anymore but this response is still triggered in situations that we perceive to be dangerous or frightening. So some anxiety can be helpful as it can help us to be more alert and focused. So it can be useful in situations when we need to perform well, such as when we have an exam or a job interview, or to help us cope in an emergency. But anxiety can be unhelpful. So while symptoms of anxiety aren't dangerous, they can be uncomfortable or frightening particularly if you don't know that the symptoms you're experiencing are signs of anxiety. Anxiety can also stop people from doing things that they want to do. And if it goes on for a long time, it can sometimes make physical problems worse, such as stomach problems or high blood pressure. So it's therefore really important to be able to recognise when you're feeling anxious, as there are strategies that you can use to help calm this threat system and to reduce your feelings of anxiety. So as well as the physical signs of anxiety that we might notice in our bodies, we might also feel nervous, worried, tense, panicky, frightened or unsettled. We might find that we are constantly worrying or that we're spending a lot of time thinking about the worst case scenarios. We might also find that we have trouble relaxing or difficulty concentrating. We might find that we're more snappy or irritable than usual. And we might avoid situations that we fear or use unhelpful coping strategies, such as smoking or drinking more alcohol. So there are some other videos within this series that will talk you through strategies that can help to calm the threat system once it's been activated. So this includes breathing exercises, muscle relaxation, and peaceful place visualizations.